All right, this here's the uh, solar disco light. I got on the, uh, I'll put my, you see it here, the uh, stand that I made. Uh, it's about the three foot tall. I'll turn here so you can see the light. This is face, this is what looks like on the ground. Let me back up and see on this, what looks like on the ground, like this. Very nice, very pretty. I'll get on this side. I'm getting away from it, you can see it coming off of it on the ground. I'll turn loud so you can see it better. There's on the ground, rolling around the ground. How far it comes. All right, back down, no light. I'll get here in the middle of it so you can see it. Facing me, what it looks like. I'm probably about, I'd say, uh, right now I'm about 30, yeah, roughly 30 feet from it. I know you can't see the, uh, on the ground from here, but, uh, this is very, very pretty. Very pretty indeed. The darker it gets, the brighter it gets. Now I'll show you one that's on the ground to show the difference. This one is close to the ground. It's right almost touching the ground, probably about six inches of it. This one here is like this. But you don't, if it's close to the ground, you do not get a big flow to it. Those lights. I'll go back to the other one now. Back to the one that's on the stand. As you can see, I don't know if I'll show you any more or not. Uh, all right, as you can see, the one on the stand gives you a much better ball of light out here. I'm gonna stand this way in front of it. Yeah, it gives you a much better ball of light when it's up on a stand than when it's close to the ground. Now I'm adjust it a little bit right here so we can you know I brought it up facing up in the air a little bit further. But it looks better when you got it facing to the ground more or adjust it down to the ground. There. When it's facing the ground up on a stand, it looks a lot better. So I got it angled to the ground right now. As you can see, it's angled to the ground. I'll cut less so you can see it angled to the ground. Yeah, I got it angled to the ground. It's on an angle up to the ground. It's got a better view to it when it's that way. Yeah, I just love this disco light. Yeah, it's really uh, awesome. Just love it. I've been doing all kinds of different things with this disco light, so yeah, it's really awesome. I'll show you something. Just hold on a second. All right, I got two disco balls right now. One facing each other. They're about uh, 20 feet apart. And it looks very awesome. One's on the up on the stand, one's on the ground. I will tell you one thing. Uh, these uh, I'll get the last thing see here. These lenses here, you have to clean these lenses off with a paper towel, or something wipe off, but they get bug doo doo on them. So if I remember, after you get these, you got to wipe these lenses off. Uh, when you use them, or they get buggy stuff on them, so. These are very awesome night lights, solar night lights. Very awesome. 
Okay, I just thought I'd show you these two together here, how they look. So there they are. There, I zoomed in a little bit better. And this in here, I zoomed in a little bit better too. Alright, well, I hope you like this. Yeah, see them goodies, see them growing. Penny goodies.